In today's video, I am going to be talking about Creamy Obsession. And I have a package from them, so I'm going to open it up and uh, show you guys what I got, and then I'll do the review right after that. Creamy Obsession is based out of Kentucky. Uh, the owner's name is Marina, and she has a YouTube channel that's really cool, so she shows how she makes her soaps. Uh, she's been, in, when I, this, I did take a peek at some of these soaps, and when you, when I show them to you, you're gonna think this person's been doing it for 20 years, and she's actually only been doing it for two plus. I think in the, the, about us, she wrote it uh, two, uh, she wrote said two years ago, and she said back in 2019. So it, even if it's three or four years still, the soap is amazing. Um, she uses some stuff, some stuff from her local, uh, from her garden. She replaced like water with some juices and things like that. Uh, these were all small batch, hand cut made. I'm gonna start with, I mean, these soaps are really nice, really nice packaging. This is Autumn Breeze. And uh, these are the type of soaps that you don't wanna use. This is made with coconut milk and shea butter. So I'll show you this soap. Oh, sm this smells like, like uh, look at that. That's really cool, you can see the tree. Um, kind of almost looks like a painting. This is a really nice bar. So, and it smells like, oh, like a spicy, um, like autumn leaves, but also with a spice to it, like a cinnamon maybe in there. I'm not sure, but it smells awesome. What I love also is that there's Tusser, Tusser Silk in here. I've used that in one of the soaps and I loved it. It gives you a very velvety feel to the soap. But here are the ingredients. You could check out all the information on their company. And I'll put that all in the thing. But all the ingredients are on the back. I'll read them real quick. Olive oil, coconut oil, distilled water, lard, sodium hydroxide, which is the lye, coconut milk, fragrance, castor oil, cocoa butter, shea butter, vitamin E oil, kylon clay, skin safe colorants, and activated charcoal, and then the tuss of silk. Awesome ingredients. Really nice looking bar. I mean, these are gifts. These are things that that you can give to someone. And this is a toast to winter. Uh, I really like that they're seasonal. I like that kind of stuff. Um, and the ingredients are pretty much the same in this one too, except they don't have tuss of silk. And, um, but I'll show you this soap because it really looks, this one's really cool. Look at that. That is so awesome. I mean, these are these are awesome looking soaps and that, that can't be easy to do. Look at that little, the little uh, sun is perfect and it, it's like a, uh, looks like a forest with snow oh, and that's I can't I don't know what this smells like but it smells very fresh and clean almost like a like a like just a, a natural soap I'm not sure what the what the scent is when I go on the website I'll look but this smells like an outdoors like an outdoor smell um it could be either way masculine or feminine I, I'm not really sure but it's really nice really nice so far these two are awesome I love them I love them both this is Harvest Moon Wolf, so cool. Uh, this has betonite clay. Oh, oh, that smells so good. Look at that. That is so cool. This is, I, every time I, I get soap, I get so excited because you think like, oh, I've done probably 60 plus videos and I, I could probably do another 300 with all the soap companies out there or more. And even the low, I do more small business, but there are larger companies that I haven't done yet that I'm going to do. But you, I still look at these and I go, wow, this, I mean, a company like this, they should be almost like in every store, there should be soap where you can get soap like this instead of buying like junk that you see in like a grocery store. This has extra virgin olive oil, which is higher in antioxidants. And because uh, when you have extra, it's, it's only cold pressed. And when it's regular virgin olive, olive oil, it, or regular olive oil, it could be heat pressed and it, that gets away from, it's like a blend, that gets away some of the, the, the um, antioxidants and stuff. But this has aloe vera juice, um, shea butter, it's pretty much the same type of stuff except the differences is the extra virgin olive oil and the aloe vera juice. Uh, but other than that, it smells, I, I, I need to look to see what these scents are because I can't put a place on it. This smells really good. They all smell really good, and they're, they're, they just have a unique scent where I can't place what it, it is. Uh, it's probably a mix, in my guess would be, it's like a mix of things. Oh, so okay. There's one more, and then she sent the sample. Really nicely packed, this came. This is Baykal Blue Clay. It's luxury soap art. This is mango butter and jojoba oil. Look at that, and the reason I know how to 
to pronounce most of these things is because of Tiki. You could follow him. I'll, I'll put a link to him. He's, a, he's awesome. I love watching his videos. And he's got a lot of good shorts out there, too, uh, that are great. But he teaches people like me who are language impaired with pronouncing things because of my New York accent uh, how to pronounce some things. That's what that's part of, like a little piece of his channel. He's doing a lot of other things, too. But uh, this is the, the clay. This is really cool. Looks like it has poppy seeds, probably for a little exfoliating. Let's see. It has tufts of silk. It has powdered sugar. Back out blue clay, chia, uh, chia, chia seed gel, a jojoba oil, brown, brown, brown rice flour, hazelnut oil, mango butter, castor oil, yogurt. This thing has tons of ingredients. I'll probably put these in the description because I don't want to spend most of the video reading them. But yeah, these, these are going to be great. I'm looking so forward to using these. And I will let you know how they are, of course, in, in the second half of the video. And then I got a sample, which is, it looks like... This is so nice, look at that. It's just like a clean little, oh, that's a mint. That I can tell that has got mint in it. So these are all really nice looking soaps. I'm excited to, to check these out. So I'll do a review soon. And um, I always say this, but, but it's like you know, two weeks for me, and, but it'll be like a second for you. Just to tack on to this video, uh, I, I saw her, I probably opened the box the opposite way, and she sent a really nice thank you card uh, with a handwritten letter, which was really nice. Uh, she's saying that uh, I really do hope you love these, and uh, some of the best ingredients I've seen in soaps. Uh, it's gonna this year is gonna be a hard year to do the top top ten because uh, these soaps are that I've been getting have been amazing. And I just love this. They send like, she sent like a little, some candy, some tea candies. Uh, it looks like there's a tea bag in there uh, with a thank you sticker and then all her information, which I'm gonna put in the description. I hope if you can read that, that's, that'll be great. But she's on about basically at Creamy Obsession on Instagram. Uh, creamyobsession.com is their website. Creamy Obsession is uh, their YouTube and then they're on Facebook and you can email them. But check them all out. It would be in the description. Highly recommend it so far from what I see and the review will be coming. So I am back. Wow, I had a couple of weeks to go over these and a couple other soaps and I'm excited to get into these. The first one I'm gonna talk about after getting back, I showed you guys uh, the original unboxing. I wasn't sure on the sense of them, I kind of guessed what they were. And, and this one is, it's, it's for $14, the, the really, I think the really nice like art, art ones that probably take a lot more time to make and they can make them in less amounts because of probably the stencils and things like that. They're a little more expensive, they're about 14. And you get the other, the other bars for about 10. And you could go on, the, on her YouTube channel, which I'm gonna show you all the information in my description. She has a YouTube channel and shows how to make some of these soaps, which are amazing. And this is really a complex scent. So I'm gonna look to the right just to make sure I get all of these. They're so, this, this is an amazing, amazing scent. And it's a mahogany, vanilla, oak moss, sandalwood, and a coconut fragrance. And and when I said this, I think I said it could go, you can basically, it's a unisex, and uh, it's just it's just such a great smell. I highly recommend this. It's probably my favorite one out of all of them, besides the look. They're all really good, actually. I don't know if I can pick one, which is usually easy for me to do, to say which one I love, but they're all so good. And this is the autumn one. It's like a cinnamon fall. And you can see the bridge there. The artwork on here is really cool. I've used both of these. I think I didn't use one of them just because I liked it so much and I wanted to keep it. And even that one is like a citrus, fizzy citrus smell. And it's really nice. Oh, this is so nice. I mean, they're just so, they're so nicely made. And I said this in uh the previous in the earlier part of the video when i was doing the unboxing that these kind of soaps and a lot of the companies that i here's the information if you could read it but i'll put all that information in there really nice packaging uh great logo great name awesome ingredients they're out of kentucky it's just such a great small business that i hope people get out there and and buy some soap from them because they're awesome they're so great this year this year the first year i was doing soap reviews were great. Like I got so many great soaps, but now I'm being overwhelmed by amazing companies. And then on top of the companies that I really loved last year, it's gonna be hard to do a top 10. I'm gonna have a tough time uh, picking these these companies because like the company like this is gonna be on my top 10. Um, they're just amazing, amazing, amazing ingredients, amazing scent. Uh, and just all around, I really enjoyed 
reviewing these and thank you for sending these out. I really appreciate it. Uh, check them out. All their information is going to be in, in the description below. It'll be on my Instagram page too. I'll put some information on there. But thank you so much for stopping by and watching this. I hope you check them out. If you have, let me know what you think of them and what your favorite bar is. And if you haven't, let me know if you're going to check them out because I think I think you'll be very happy if you did. Uh, the price may seem a little high at 14, but I'm telling you it's worth it. The soap lasts pretty long, and it's it's such a high quality soap, and the ingredients are so good that I think you, it's worth the extra penny just to just to to, to experience how good this soap is. So let me know what you think. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.